Ask Tom on Home Show. Stephen from Sharpstown has a little fan frustration. Yeah, it's his AC. He's got a train five-year-old Train XR AC unit with a troublesome fan. Stephen writes to us. He says the condenser fan motor would stop on a hot afternoon when the temperature reached about 100 degrees. And the installer told me this motor, this one right here, is uh, is has a heat protection device in it. And it let and he says I let it cool down an hour and it would work again, which it did. He says the problems happen twice a year, so it's so annoying when you get it when it oh. stop when it when you need it the most it stops. He says, I want to know does this explanation hold true, or is my motor defective? I can I can answer it this way. Number one, I've never heard of such a thing. Those units are meant to run in Las Vegas, Nevada, on the rooftop. Uh, or in New Mexico, Arizona, and of course in Houston, we put them on the ground, but they, those fan motors are supposed to run. Now, did this particular fan motor have some kind of safety device, which makes no sense at all to me? Maybe. So you change the fan motor to something different uh, that doesn't have it, but my units would never stop. Charlie, I don't think your units ever stop. So it, it would behoove me to think that a technician would come up with such a lame excuse as opposed to saying, hey, it's time for us to change your fan motor because he's going to get the labor cost. And if it's a warranty call, they get a new fan motor and put it in. So I am very, uh, I, I don't know if it's really true, but my answer to this is if it is, get rid of it, get a different fan motor. It should never be cutting off, especially that one outside like that. It makes no sense at all. So Something is not adding up and putting all the pieces together as far as the question goes. I would look into it and I would change it. I think it would be horrible when you need it the most. It shuts down. That makes no sense. All right. You got a question? We'll make sense of it for you. Click on the blue Ask Tom button and fill out this form. Send in your questions. Attach a picture like, like Stephen did there. It really helps us to understand what's going on and do a better job. And we want to do that for you. It's why we do these. We post them every day here on our YouTube channel and at homeshowradio.com.